All right, everyone. What up, guys? It's me, Gamer Guy TV here. Um, so before we get started, as you can tell by the title of this video, I would hope this is Oxen Free. Now, I have no idea what this game is about, uh, what it looks like. I haven't played it before, unlike two of our sort of epic games point in the channel. Um, or three, sorry. But I have no idea what this looks like, what any of the characters are. I have no idea the controls, although all video games are the same basic, simple controls. Um, but a few things before we get started. A, I am in the home stretch with two and a half weeks of school left. So I have a fun project planned for the beginning of summer. So be on the lookout for that. Um, also, within those two and a half weeks, I'm going to be recording a uh, seventh grade reflection. Just for myself, I'm recording it with webcam so I have the video as like a log of, you know, what I look like with what I sound like, but I'm not gonna do the face cam on video. Um, and then, I'm also, I'm contemplating doing something, but I'm not entirely sure what I wanna do, so. Um, also guys, Fortnite uh, thumbnails, thumbnail is gonna be changing. What I've decided to do is, because I think we're going to be in this phase, um, you know, like, Roblox and Stack the States was phase one. Like, Fortnite, Sly Merchant, Subnautica, Oxenfree, The Witness, um, Little Alchemy. Those are sort of going to be phase two. And since I feel like we're going to be in phase two for at least a year, I am doing something where we do one thumbnail per season for Fortnite. We obviously changed the episode number, but anyway, let's get right into Oxenfree. Hopefully it used to be a military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit, unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. Oh, and good then one things. year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Alex? Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like 10 minutes. Yeah, yeah, my, my mind drifted for a oh, second. Oh, it's like an adventure game. So you all moved in? Um, not, not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a, you know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> okay. Uh, yes, please don't. Let's not relive their meet cute any more than we have to. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um, I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what does that make you to her, then? Hey, uh, second cousin? I don't know He's how... He's my stepbrother. Oh, yeah. I forgot that was even a thing. I'm just well, at least you seem choosing cool, something right? at random, guys. Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing your clothes. Eating your food. I'm gonna do this because I'm curious. Smelling up. Yeah, no, it's a nice perk, I guess. Unless you're like a pyro or something. Just a klepto, so you're in luck. So, how do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic, grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato blobs. <laughs> And to date, that's still what I think she looks like under her clothes. We'll be Hopefully this is kept to Make PG. sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. And if you picked up a complimentary disposal uh, wait, radio, who's talking right now? It's a recording. They always play. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. If you're more about the 
This will be like the before shot. Yeah, let's do it. And it's Jonas? Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, AIDS guy? It's, um, biblical, right? Or is that the lion guy? I think every name's biblical, so probably. Here's good. Come on, Alex, join the fun. Sorry, guys, my computer went into Chinese. Need a girl in the picture, Alex, to balance some of this out? There, great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Hey, Alex, you brought the radio, right? The little portable one? What radio? That little, you know, the little, it almost looks like a toy. The, uh, oh, oh, you're joking. Just bring it out, will you? There's the little guy. Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. She's filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing. So, tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. 88.3. It's, uh, to the left of the dial? Guys, sorry I'm not talking much. I'm just trying to let the game... been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. But, oh... Oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach, or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. <laughs> That's awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. We must be getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. Sure. We'll see. We'll see, guys. I like this game. I feel like this is going to be a fun game. And also, sorry if the video seems a bit uneventful, because I'm trying to keep them at around 15 minute videos. So. Again, my apologies if it seems very uneventful. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. And Boy and girl. Friend. This ain't city living. Yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, you can bum one off me if you're empty. I forget if you're a fellow addict. Oh, uh, no thanks. I don't smoke. Last time I had don't one, smoke, it kid. didn't go well. Yeah, no, I didn't know what coughing with your whole body meant until I saw you dry heaving. <laughs> okay, just checking. All right, my other friend should be up and around the bend. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have, like, two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends? Uh, really? Just... That's kind of... Uh, what could you possibly have to say that Ren can't hear? It's not like that. It's nothing, really. It's just something I want to talk to you about super fast, that's all. All right, bud. <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're going to have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all going to meet up with them. It's no, like... it's, it's fine, Ren. Go on up ahead and we'll catch up with you. Um, okay, I guess. Though this is a really strange way to start off splitting up. It'll be fast. Thanks, man. I'll just be up the hill, in case... whatever. Anyone see that Ren right there? seems nice. He's funny, you know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. Yeah, I mean, he's harmless. But, yeah, he's nice. Listen, 
I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I've, I've never moved anywhere. And like getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training wheels. And not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. It'll just be a lot to adjust to, I guess. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house, so this is an... That was, um... That was Mike's room, actually. So, there wasn't that much to set up. Oh. Oh, man, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to bring it up. It's okay, you didn't know. She doesn't seem too happy. I heard okay. your mom I heard about your mom. I'm sorry. Yeah, you know. What are you gonna do? We can catch back up with Ren now. I didn't mean to take so long. That's just a quick sign that tells you what things are. It's helpful to know. Store. Can I walk in the store? No. No, I can't. Off road. I'm just exploring here, guys. Um, hopefully I'm not echoing audio too much. If I am, I'm sorry. I don't have the best. I don't have the best recording software. Yeah, it's a statue. Thanks, Captain Obvious. Park's office. We go in. Oh, we can't. We need to catch up with Ren, is what it said. I've just been exploring because I'm curious. Hello, kids. Look, the other guys and gals must be further up, so be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Sounds Nobody like every lives here, except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. We are here to drink and be stupid, a tradition apparently started by bored recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal towns. They literally called it trawling. Uh huh. Really? That's kind of gross. Yeah, sex is gross. So disgusting. Man, get a room, you soldiers. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here after dark. The town is shut down, and we, the Kamina High junior class, have come to commit improper acts. And the other the thing street. is the weird okay. This is to the left. The Weirdo caves. Cliffs. The whole reason Alex brought her radio is because when you go to the... It's like the front. The mouth. The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes pick up frequencies to stations that don't exist. You'll hear voices or just sounds. And they're impossible to get any... It's, um, it's pretty creepy. At least I've heard. I did it once. It's amazing when it works. So, back up a second. Who's Mrs. Adler? Her family, I think, like, owns or owns some of the island or something? She's been shacked in the same spot for like 70 years. She's kind of what you call the local legend. She has a house on the other side of the woods. Man, that woman won the life lottery. 70 years of sleeping with the window open and smelling the ocean. You'd be okay with never leaving. Never leaving. Just there. All the time. Well, if it's on an island, then yeah. Monkey butlers, lobster wives. It's the dream. Oh yeah, what was I thinking? Lobster wives. It's the dream. Jonas, did you know that a little birdie told me that our Alex here is thinking of going out of state to college? Oh, really? Yeah, so... Don't All get... right, so what if I am? I don't know. So what if you are? I guess it's nothing. No big deal. I just... 
if you are thinking of leaving, I just hope you're doing it for the right reasons. That's all. That's my whole spiel. Ren, why do you even care about this? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because you're my friend? And I'll miss you if you go? That's what a friend does. They miss the other person. And I don't want you to regret yeah, anything. So, yeah. Never mind. Oh, Ren. You big knucklehead. I miss you too, okay? But for now, I'm not gone yet, and who knows what I'm gonna do, so... All right, all right. Oh, you two are like kittens in a paper sack. Ugh, what is that? It's a saying. No, it isn't. <laughs> Alright. So guys, this is a pretty good stopping point. Um, if there's like... a save game, that would be nice. Photos. We've taken two... Okay, I think it auto-saves, but thank you guys for watching, uh, this was the best stopping point we had. This also looks like a really awesome game in addition to Subnautica. Hopefully the audio worked out fine, I will mess with that next time, and see ya.